Hello friends, welcome back to a Cinderella wish. If you're new here, I am Mia. And today what I have for you is a huge Disney Cruise Line haul. My family and I went on the Disney wish. So we went on our first Disney cruise ever. Actually, it was our first cruise ever. And what a way to experience being on the seas for four nights. And I'm gonna say, uh, yeah, four days. Yeah, I'm gonna say it was four, full four days. Although the first day was kind of half, and then the last day was really just a quick breakfast and a checkout. Anyway, if you haven't seen any of our videos, I will leave the link for our videos in the description box below. Before we start, I wanna say something about the cruise. It was the best vacation ever that we've had in nine years. We have not had a vacation in nine years. Yes, nine years. Except for when we moved from California to Florida, I wouldn't call that a vacation. I would call that a little quick road trip because we drove here. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you, if you haven't experienced Disney Cruise Line, there is none other. The parks, no. You're not gonna get the quality, the service, the cleanliness that you're gonna get on the Disney Cruise. If you agree with me, let me know. If you don't agree with me, let me know. Oh, don't forget to tell me why. Anyway, okay, let's get started. Uh, the first thing, when we walked into the Disney Wish, we were greeted, of course they called our names, and then they greeted us with a magic wand. Bibbity, bobbity, boo. This magic wand is very special because, first of all, it says Disney Wish. Second of all, you can walk around with it and interact with everyone and all the characters if you want to. What I did was I forgot my magic wand several times and on the last day, well, I could have used this magic wand. That's okay because Fairy Godmother was there and she took care of it. All right. I know, I gotta get started. Anyway, so the magic wand was a gift from the Disney Cruise. When we walked into our room, we also were told that there were little items around that we can take home with us. Now, uh, I'm gonna show you what they are. They're postcards. Here's the Disney Cruise Line. And here is the Disney Cruise Line with Mickey and Minnie really cute i think i'm going to frame these or put them in our album with our photos and i'm going to be doing also i don't know if you guys think it's okay to do it or not but let me know comment below i was going to show you and tell you if it's worth or let you decide if it's worth uh picking up the photo package for well it was almost 200 dollars for the photo package anyway i would like to share those photos with you in another video, in a quick video. This one's not gonna be so quick, so stand by here. I know, keep going, right. Anyway, <laughs> the other thing was, I thought this was really cool. You have two envelopes, and you have two pieces of paper, and you can write a little letter to someone while you're on the cruise. Now, we didn't, we just took this home with us because it was available and it's really nice to have. And so we took it home with us. The other items we received were chocolates every night that we were on the cruise. Okay, but they're gone. All right. Now, I think I'm gonna start with when we were in the Bahamas, okay? What we picked up. This was quick. We didn't pick up too many things, but we did pick up two items in the Bahamas because um, we just wanted to help the locals out. So Ricky picked out this hat, which him and his dad, they're gonna share it, and it says, since 1973. 
Ricky likes numbers too, so he, this is why he picked out, and it says Bahamas. And it's weathered and tethered, and that's just the look of it. But this is what Ricky picked out. What I picked out was a hat, a bucket hat, with Ariel on it. Now there were princesses ones with tiaras, there were different ones, but I thought this one was really cute because Ariel has a bow in her hair. It's not perfect, the body should really line up, but it was the only one they had, and like I said, I just wanted to help them out. And um, it says Bahamas on it. It's really cute, it's nice to wear to the beach, or to the parks too. And who doesn't love Ariel? Ariel's perfect, right? Water, Ariel, yes, mermaid, perfect. So you guys know that The Wish is a newer ship, or the newest ship from the Disney Cruise Line, and some inaugural merchandise was still available. So we picked up Mickey and Minnie Plush. Now, I almost passed on Minnie, and I'll tell you why. I didn't see her lashes, and I'm like, she kind of looks like Mickey. And then I took note that her she does have lashes. She has that one eyebrow there, <laughs> look, which I'd never seen on Minnie before. But she's so cute, and she does have eyelashes. She is adorable, and both of them have the inaugural stamp on the bottom, and it says Disney Wish. So, yes, Mickey and Minnie, or Captain Mickey and Captain Minnie plush. So I am going to show you all the clothes merchandise since that's what I started with. I'm going to keep going with the clothes that we purchased. Ricky fell in love with this cap because it was red and had blue. And he liked the fact that it was Disney Wish in gold. He just liked the way it looked. The hardware in gold and the red and the blue just looked really nice together, appealing to his eye, and he picked up this cap. My husband picked out this cap for himself, and Ricky helped him, because it's very subtle. It's like a drawing and a, I don't know what you want to call this, like a drawing of the ship. It's very subtle. It has um, an anchor, and it also, right here it says, let me see if I can get that in focus. There you go, Disney Wish, and it has the cruise ship. It also has the Disney logo for the cruise ship, the DCL logo. And he liked it a lot, and this is what he picked up for himself. My husband's really not a shopper, so wow, when he picked that out, wow. Fireworks were going off. Okay, this was not purchased on the Disney Cruise. They did have tons of lanyards on the cruise, and we did not purchase them there because we were at Disney Character Warehouse and one of our viewers and her family just came off the cruise and she told us, look, they have a few, three specifically, left because we're getting the rest of them and do you want us to get, get them for you? And I said, oh sure. And she went and she got them. I said, what do I need these for? And she said, well, you're gonna have to carry your room key around with you to open the door of your room. And also you can pay with the key. You can pay for your merch. So I was like, okay, cool. So we purchased them for $5.99 and it saved us some money. And we were very pleased with that because who doesn't like to save money? Anyway, the way I spend money, it's great when uh, I can save some. Anyway, Disney, Disney's got me. All right, here we go. This t-shirt here, is a t-shirt I picked up for myself because it says Disney Wish on it. It's very simple. It's just striped with a red collar or, or a red ribbing. And um, it's just red, white, and blue with the gold. You know, you don't only have to wear this on the Wish. You can wear it anywhere. So I picked this one up for myself. It's a little cropped and I like it. 
Um, let's see here. Ricky. Well, Ricky's another one that likes to shop. He picked up this t-shirt, Captain Mickey Mouse. And it does say wish. And Captain Mickey is looking through a portal. Super cute. And wait, because one is not enough for Ricky. They are so soft. They are so like soft. Anyway, this blue is gorgeous. And this is the one I showed him, but he picked out that one. And then he went back and he said he wanted this one as well. And this one has all the main characters. Well, Mickey and friends it has Mickey and Goofy and Donald and Pluto and Chip and Dale. It is missing the girls, Minnie and Daisy. But you know, someone has to steer that ship. So I'm sure Minnie was, um, that's what she was doing. And Daisy, well, you know, she had to make herself a little more glamorous, you know, do her makeup, you know, you know how that goes with Daisy. Before I forget, let me show you these ears. These ears I picked up. Okay, there were several beautiful ears that I almost picked up, but I didn't. It was a toss up between this one and the 25th anniversary ears for Disney Cruise Line, which had a captain hat on it. But you know, many of you know that I love princesses. So when I saw these and they had Rapunzel on it and Pascal, I couldn't pass these up. And another thing, I love painting and I love to draw. Well, I did it one time. I haven't done it in many years and I keep saying I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I'm go That's why I took the art class on board because I'm gonna get into it. I'm gonna train my hands and my eyes again, but I haven't done it yet. But I'm going to, I'm going to, I'll find time. Okay, so back to the ears. So. They're really cute, and you can see, they do say Disney Wish. And um, the original ones, I would have never picked up because they have a boat on top, and I prefer them like this with a bow. So that's probably why I didn't buy the one with the hat, because I do prefer bows somehow. They just appeal to me. But I thought the hat one was cute and as well. All right, now. I also picked up this little baby. There was one for the 25th anniversary. It also had the captain hat on. It matched the headband ears, but this one to me was more appealing. And I don't know, it's just not like a year anniversary. It was just, you know, you anytime, anywhere. And it's just DCL, it doesn't, Oh, it does say Disney Wish. So it's Disney Wish merchandise. And it has this cute bow and, you know, I just said I love bows. I love the gold hardware with the blue. And you can see there's uh, Chip and Dale, Captain Minnie, um, Donald Duck, the ship, the logo, the steering wheel, which there's a name for it, but steering wheel. Anchor on the side, there's Goofy. Yeah, Goofy and Pluto's up here. Another Captain Mini. And let's see what else. What else is there here? Yeah, I said Captain Mickey, right? Yeah, okay, Captain Mickey. <laughs> Um, like you're gonna answer me from there. Anyway, I don't know. It's just really nice and it has this ivory and gold plate that says Disney Wish Lounge Fly and um, The ears are cute and there's pretty sturdy and The back straps are navy. They're just I don't know. I just fell in love with this bag and that's the one I want Oh on the inside. Let's check out and see what's on the inside. On the inside, there's no characters. It's just um, like an anchor, the wheel, the Disney Cruise Line logo. And it's blue inside. It is so gorgeous, so gorgeous, yes. It's your standard lounge fly, but it's just it's beautiful, beautiful. All right, so this is Ricky's. 
he picked out this little Disney Cruise Line ship because he likes these little toys and he keeps them in his room and they don't break. And this one rolls. Um, it's just cute. And he picked it up because he liked it. More Rapunzel. Okay, I'm gonna put on my glasses for this because I can't see the detail on it. All right, here is the Disney Wish Rapunzel ornament. And there's Rapunzel. She's going to go to the front of the ship to paint the front of the ship. Look at her hair, it wraps around. Disney Wish. Little feet. In the back there's the Disney logo for the Disney Cruise Line. And where were we? We were, I think we were here on this side or were we on the other side? I don't know, I think we were on this side. And um, we were closer to the metal on the ship. Look at the little anchor that dangles. So cute. Yeah. And the waves on the bottom. This is the water. Oh, I didn't notice that before. There's the uh, Disney Cruise Line logo, Tinkerbell, and Jiminy Cricket. I'm glad they're there, though. Here's a tumbler from Tervis. My husband picked this out because he liked the fact that some of the proceeds go to the Make-A-Wish Foundation. And there is Captain Mickey on one side and Captain Minnie on the other. It was from the inaugural cruise. Um, they still have these, or I don't know how much they have left, but there were some. And this is a Tervis, so it's really, really sturdy. And Tervis is just such a good quality. So he picked this up for himself. Are you ready? Here's the star of the show, okay? But let me tell you the story behind this. There were none left. And I was like a little upset that I wasn't gonna get one. So I talked to one of the cast members and she was manager in the store and I said, I really, really want it. It's my first cruise, and it's my first cruise ever. It's my first cruise on the Disney Wish. Is there anything you can do? Can you send it to me? She said, tell you what, there's one in customer service. Now, I don't know if that is beat up, the one that's there, but if it's not, it'll be yours. I said, okay, let me show you, and you'll see why. I was so excited to receive this. A dream is a wish your heart makes. Cinderella. And on the back, it's Lucifer. And Gus Gus and Jack Jack. Or Jack and Gus. But I had to have this. In the videos, you can see that this statue this mini statue, there is a large statue of Cinderella with Lucifer and the mice on the ship when you walk into the main area of the ship. So yeah, I just had to have this. It is gorgeous and I love it. I love her. Love, love. Yeah. And I even tell my husband, stay away from her because you know what? They didn't have the box to this. They had to wrap it really well, and I was so protective of this because there is no box for it. So anyway, I'm so excited I have her. That's another thing. See, they go out of their way on that ship to do anything and everything possible that they can do for you. And yeah, so they do go out of their way a little bit more than the parks, to be honest. That's my experience and that's what I found. Oh, wait, let me show you what I have on my wrist. Yes, it's a Pandora bracelet, but we're gonna talk about this charm right here, which is the ship and the anchor. Now this is just a, a ship, so it's just any Disney Cruise Line ship. It's not the wish, but check out the little anchor. I wanted this dangle so I can complete my um, travel Pandora charm bracelet. Uh, this Captain Minnie I already had, 
but um yeah i'll let me show you what my bracelet looks like okay so we've been to hawaii several times several several times and we lived in california so it was a lot easier but we've been there several times including our honeymoon my husband and mine um and ricky has been there several times after our honeymoon of course so we have stitch and we have lilo then we have the disney cruise line ship and anchor captain minnie then you have donald then you have a compass let me move this around a little bit. Here's a car because we've traveled a lot by car. And here's a camera because I was a photographer at one time and I still like to take pictures. Although I, although I need a better camera for that. No, not that you can't just take a good picture with your phone or just a, a mediocre camera. It's just that, I don't know. I'm just kind of used to the other way. Anyway. Let me get back to this. There is a um, place that I would love to go one day, and it's called Disneyland Paris. So here's the castle. Never been there before, or we've never been there before, but it's a goal, one day. And then here's butterflies and a flower because I love the spring. And Paris in the spring. Oh, I would really love that. Um, okay, now what? Now we have here we have Daisy, we have a luggage bag, we have Ariel the Mermaid, let me see if I can get her in focus, we have Ariel the Mermaid with a pearl on the bottom, then we have an airplane for travel, and then we have a Havaiana slipper, a drink, and the Brazilian flag because we have traveled to Brazil many times or I have my husband has traveled once and my son has traveled once to Brazil but yeah so we have this on here and the only place that I have not um, I don't have on here is other places that I've traveled to like Mexico but I didn't travel with my family so I don't have that on here so I'm not gonna put this on my bracelet um my husband has been to other places like spain and other, but he wasn't with me or my son so i'm not going to put that on here either hopefully paris will be one of our destinations in the near future just keep wishing and your wishes do come true just have to have a little patience like i always say okay moving on ricky picked out this mug for himself because he liked it it's Mickey and Minnie. It's the wish. Captain Mickey and Minnie. The colors are beautiful. There's nothing on the inside. But it is a really pretty mug with a pretty handle. My son, Ricky, also picked out this magnet that will go up on the fridge and we're going to put our photo in here and it says it's time to cruise and it says 2023 it's just a perfect little disney cruise uh, magnet and this magnet is not specific to the wish but this magnet is it's a beautiful gold magnet and it says disney wish and i picked that one out here is another ornament that you can only find on the disney wish and it's Cinderella, and there's the Disney Wish ship. And it just says Disney Wish down here, and it is gorgeous, gorgeous. But then everything Cinderella's gorgeous. So as far as pins, I only picked up two. Here's the first one. It says Disney Wish, and there's the Disney logo, and right here it says Inaugural Sailing, and right here it has the ship. But if you look, you can see Cinderella in gold. And then you can see the Mickey ears or uh, emblem right back there. I think that's the firework. No, it's not the fireworks. It's just an emblem, like a hidden Mickey. And right, and right here, here's the DCL logo. It's a stunning, stunning pin, stunning. Did I say stunning? Well, it's stunning. Okay, um, next. This is another favorite of mine. Oh my goodness, I think I love everything I purchased. 
Okay, so this Disney Wish pin has Rapunzel painting the Disney Wish. And she moves. Isn't that cool? So cool. This is a pretty big pin too. Let me see, one, two, three inches maybe across. Where the other one is probably like, um, could be, I don't think, I don't even think it's two inches. It's a little smaller than that. Okay, I'm not done yet. You thought I was done, didn't you? Mm -mm. One more item. Wait a minute, but it's not one more item. One more item from the ship. Then we get to cast away key. All right, so I'm gonna open this, cause you know what? I have not yet opened this little package here. So let's see what's in this little package. Okay guys, are you ready? There it is, the ship. And it says Disney Wish on it right there, Disney Wish. It doesn't have Rapunzel on it, but uh, it is the ship. Nevertheless, it is the ship. Let me take it out of the plastic. Okay, here we go. Let's take a look at the ship closer. There you can see the pool, there you can see the water slide, the front and the back of the ship, but there is no Rapunzel. It does say Disney Wish right here. And there's the lifeboats. And then you have to use your imagination on where you were on the ship. Um, this is so beautiful. My husband wanted this for his office. But I don't know. I kind of want to. I want everything. No. Um, yeah, I'll probably give it to him since I have Cinderella. But uh, yeah, it's a beauty. That's it for the Disney Cruise ship, The Wish. Now we're going to show you what we picked up on Castaway Key. A nice blue cap it says Castaway Key, Bahamas. And my husband picked up this cap. Not that he really wanted it, but Ricky insisted that he get one because Ricky got one. He likes his dad to have a cap too. But Ricky's does not look like that. Ricky's looks like this. Castaway Key Bahamas. And it's a beautiful color. It just looks like the water. So I guess that's why Ricky picked it out. Okay, mine. Where is my cap? Oh, there it is. This one's for me. It's a coral. Coral pink. Or salmony pink. It says also Castaway Key and it says has your Disney Cruise Line logo. And there we go. And there's the logo on the hardware. So yeah, those are the caps. Oh wait, but Ricky, of course, can I go anywhere without purchasing a t-shirt? So we didn't get a t-shirt, my husband and I, but Ricky did, he picked out this one. And this one is Goofy and the surfboard and it says, Ocean A, not a care. Or Ocean I, not a care. Yeah, it's cute. And um, then I had to pick up two pins because I couldn't leave without purchasing something else, of course. I didn't purchase enough, so I have to go purchase more. So this one here is Castaway K. No, it's not. Actually, I purchased it on Castaway K, but this was also available on the ship. It says catching some Z's on the high seas and it's tink and you can see the portal in the back it's adorable look at her she is so cute oh my goodness tink awake is adorable tink sleeping is even more adorable okay so the only pin i did get from castaway key was this one welcome 
Castaway Key. And it has Mickey and Pluto. And look at Mickey's feet. Look at the him in the flip-flops. How cute is that? Very cute. Very. Okay, well, let's see. Anything else? Hmm. I think that's it. If there's anything else I forgot to mention, we'll leave it for another time. But I think I got everything. And I would say this video is pretty long for a haul. So I'm going to wrap it up. We're going to wrap it up with wishes. I wish that all your dreams come true and your stay will be as magical as ours. Bibbity, bobbity, boo. I'll see you real soon. Bye, everybody. Thank you for watching.